frequently asked what's the most, what are the common problems that I see in my patients, in my patient population, is typically an elderly group and so forth. And one of those is compression fractures of the, of the spine. Uh, typically it can occur in thoracic or lumbar area. Um, and typically it occurs in women who are postmenopausal women uh, that have osteoporosis. And that says everybody knows a weakening of the bones. And with a fall and sometimes just a minimal gesture, uh, coughing, sneezing is enough to cause a fracture. And I have a model here uh, of what happens. Uh, and this is a model of the vertebrae. And what occurs in this situation is the, the bone itself actually collapses down. It compresses. And it becomes very, very painful to the patients to the point where frequently they can't move. They're in so much pain. They're bedridden and so forth. And in an elderly person, that's one of the worst things that you can do is keep them uh, bedridden and so forth. So there's a procedure that we do and I do um, which is called kyphoplasty and the idea is to place inside the bone itself a needle and that needle is attached to a balloon that allows us to inflate the balloon and raise the fracture uh, so that it obtains more of its normal height than was present before. Once you've done that you deflate the balloon, you remove it and then you inject it with cement as you see depicted here. Um, as a surgeon that's a very uh, rewarding procedure because I have patients who are bedridden in severe pain and literally in a matter of minutes they are pain free. Uh, this is typically an outpatient procedure. Uh, patients go home the same day um, and that's it. It's a, it's a, a quick easy fix for this problem.